Hi, this is Line 6 Will, here to talk to you about the Pod HD 500 and 500X Deep Edit Amp and Cab features. These features allow you to adjust the characteristics of each amp model, power amp, as well as the characteristics of each cab. To access these features, press down on the set list knob until you see the signal chain and use the direction arrow until the arrow is on top of the picture of the amp. Then double tap the enter button while the amp is highlighted. On page one, you will have your basic amp edit parameters. Here's the amp and preamp type. Notice deep edit features are not available when using just a preamp. Then we have cab and mic. The complete list of cab and mic models can be found in the manual in chapter six. Number four is CTL. Choose between adjusting controls for Amp A or Amp B. This feature will only be active when creating a dual tone, otherwise it will stay on Amp A. Press the arrow button to get to page two, which offers some parameters for adjusting the power amp. First up is master. Adjust the power amp distortion. The lower it's set, the less effect other parameters will have. Next is sag. Minimum offers a tighter response, a maximum will offer more touch to dynamic and sustain. Next is hum. This controls how much heater hum and AC ripple interacts with your tone. At the maximum setting, things get real freaky. And on page three, we continue with the power amp. First one is bias. Change the bias of the power tubes. Set the minimum to achieve a very cold class AB biasing at maximum, the amp is operating in class A. Next one is bias excursion. This determines how the power amp's tube's voicing reacts when they are pushed hard. Set low for a tighter feel, set high for a more tube compression. This parameter is highly reactive with the drive and master settings. On page four, we start adjusting the cab's parameters. First one, ER. Sets the amount of early reflections. Higher values add more reflective room sound to your amp tone. Two is low cut. Applies low frequency attenuation. Helpful to lighten up the low end of your tone. Some good suggestions is selecting mic model 57 on axis would be a good choice on a greenback 412 for metal tones, or the 87 with a blackface Lux for some nice clean tones. But it's all up to you and what you think sounds best. And on to page five. Number one, ResLev. Adjust the overall level of the modeled speaker's resonance, which results in a more lively, brighter response in the higher settings. Increasing the resonance level will cause the overall volume to increase as well. Thump. Adjust the low frequency level of the modeled speaker resonance. Just as the name implies, increasing the value on this knob will add more low-end thump to the cab tone. And decay. This adjusts the decay time of the modeled speaker resonance. This control provides the feel of a tighter speaker cone at lower values and a looser at higher values. And that's a summary of the deep edit features on the amp models and cabs on the Pod HD 500 and 500X. Enjoy it!